the format of the robot. On February 17, 2001, the episode Squid's Day Out but upon the release of the episode, people reported that the episode was heavily altered and darker than the original episode. According to one of animators, Andrew Overtoon, he reported that the episode wasn't meant to be edited, but a disgruntled ex-employee of Nickelodeon Studios had reportedly tinkered the episode into something as horrifying and disturbing as the original episode itself. The episode came from a USB drive labeled, F17-1, which was the original episode's premiere. After the USB was given, the episode officially aired around 8.15pm, right around Nickelodeon and Nicktoons respectively, however the events that were recollected were details, that seemed more darker, or just slightly off-putting from the original episode. The episode started with the title card, before starting off, everything seemed normal, until the part where Mr. Krabs flies backwards and slams behind a shelf. The stuff that fell were normal, up until the last frame, the diver suit had a small detail, what could be described was an eyeball near the window of the suit, but it was only for just a brief second. The episode continued like normal, up until the dialogue where Squidward tells Spongebob that he can wear two hats and run the cash register. The dialogue had a flickering sound before it cut off, from what Squidward mouthed, you could tell that Squidward said. I hope you burn! This wasn't the normal campy Spongebob adventure, this felt more darker and maybe even adult for some people. The episode continued like normal, before it got to the scenes where Squidward imagined the wacky and dangerous things that Spongebob would have done to the Krusty Krab. Instead, the first one showed an angry Patrick, and an angry Spongebob, like the episode Pappy Hike. Patrick barked. Hey Spongebob! Spongebob barked back. Hey Patrick! They both said this before Patrick screamed. Can I train you this quarter for a dollar? Spongebob ripped the cash register and grabbed the dollars. Here you go! Spongebob screamed. Again, the episode continued like normal, up until the scene where Squidward would think Spongebob would burn the Krusty Krab. The dialogue was replaced with, I will trash the Krusty Krab and get Squidward in trouble. Now, the dialogue was also altered differently like the last scene, which was even more obscure. Finally, it got to the ending of the episode, where it revealed that the restaurant was set from closed to open. Instead of Squidward deflating, he grabbed the cash register and smashed against his head, falling down heavily. After the reports started filling in, the episode had to be re-edited for later airings, because if they re-edit the episode again, people would have raised red flags. So the dialogue was fixed, the angry scene was replaced with the original scene, and the original ending was replaced with Squidward deflating. 